Hey guys, this is Aaron from Geeky Lemon Development and welcome back to our final and fourth part to our map view application series. So in the previous episodes we've uh, kind of implemented the map view. We've got the uh, satellite and hybrid view all set up. Uh, it enables us to get our location uh, zoomed in already on a certain location on the map view and as you can say we see we got a map pin there displaying Brooklyn Bridge New York this uh, episode we're going to be able to get directions from either our current location or any location you want to set in the uh, on the um, directions straight to Brooklyn Bridge so yeah we're going to implement that right now so all we need to do is go into our view controller H and we need to add another action button so we do ID action and this one we call it directions and that with a semicolon. Now I'm going to copy that and paste it in our view controller that hem. So it's just quickly and easier to uh, kind of do the code in there. Right, I do, you know, I'll put a few enters there so I can scroll down a bit and you can clearly see what I'm typing. So what we need to do is create an NS string and we do at symbol, um, sorry, asterisk. Uh, we simply name it. Uh, URL string and we do space equals space asterisk and, and two quotation marks and that with a semicolon. Now we'll come back to that in just a second, but now we do bracket UI application, uh, shared application, and then open URL uh, bracket NSURL space URL with string and then that's going to equal our URL with string which we'll put in our kind of two quotation marks just here so we finish those up with two um, brackets and press semicolon and now in this kind of uh, two quotation marks here we're going to put in now the um, URL link to Apple Maps. You can even use Apple Maps or Google Maps, and it's totally up to you. But as the simulator has built in Apple Maps, we're going to be using that to bring up the application to uh, set the um, end destination to our um, Brooklyn Bridge. And all you need to do is import your current location or any location you want to start um, getting directions. So the URL to Apple Maps is HTTP. Uh, colon forward slash forward slash uh, maps dot apple dot com forward slash maps um, question mark d a d d r equals now what we need to do here now is after the equals here we import our kind of coordinates to our Brooklyn Bridge so after the first that equals there we import our latitude coordinates and then we do a comma and now we need to put in place in our longitude comment so put them in just how you've set them up up here and then after that that's completely done there so if we go to our storyboard.m and now I add a button to the top and if I can select the directions Now I know the uh, nav bar doesn't like plain styled uh, buttons, so I select it to bordered. There we go. And now click on view controller or at the bottom here. Go to our connections expector and select direction and link it up to our directions button. Touch up inside, something very simple. Okay, so if we go back to our view controller, just explain it. When we hit direction, it's gonna kind of get this string here, the Apple Map string and the set coordinates to uh, open with our URL which will kind of in general open up with the shared application our Apple map so if we just build one now and simply show you it will give up the directions and set the end coordinates to uh, well the end if I just press directions here you see it brings up Apple maps and there you go so it sets the end destination to our coordinates preset for Brooklyn Bridge now in the start location here you can add any location say your you know in your own house and you want to put your own address in there or you can simply you know click current location to where you are right now now as the simulator is already kind of um, well thinks it's in California it's going to select our current location as California now we can either select car walk or bus uh, bus and walking from California to New York is going to be a while so it's car nice and easy 
we hit root and it just gives it a minute to uh, load in as you can see at the top there and then it finds you the quickest route to uh, from the California to New York now you got a couple of uh, different kind of routes you could select and it's averaging on a day and 20 hours so that's simply then how you can add directions within the map view application of your um, kind of apps so yeah I hope you've enjoyed this series so far as you can see it's very very simple to create your own styled kind of uh, map application so I hope you use these tutorials to your best advantage and I really do hope they're helping in your apps or projects at the moment if you like the series so far make sure you leave us a comment or send us a message you can suggest any tutorials you want to see in the future make sure you like and favorite uh, the video and um, follow and uh, like us on Facebook and Twitter and also check out all our apps just by simply searching Geeky Lemon on the App Store but if you haven't make sure you subscribe and I'll see you all next time in our next tutorials come on Bob come on come on Bob oh I got it in my pinky I got it in my no it's not my pinky I got it in my finger